on season two of the WCS Wild Audio Podcast. It all begins with trees. The greatest sequester of carbon is the tree. Mother Nature has given us this incredible piece of hardware. And if we can save these forests and we can save these trees, we can do some incredible things. We can help protect biodiversity, save biodiversity, but at the same time, save ourselves. The concept that we always use is educate, advocate, and lobby. So what we've been able to do using that model is identify partners, and we now have over 30 partners. This generation of incoming students feels pretty betrayed and knows that they're inheriting a role that's broken, um, and especially on issues of climate change above all else, there is a sense of urgency and a demand that we in higher ed do more, pay more attention. Overseeing a team managing three seascapes across the country, Ravika's role is an extensive one. She explains that Madagascar's status as a biodiversity hotspot is what fuels subsistence and for-profit economies here. Madagascar has 23 regions, and 15 among which are coastal. And most of them are in remote zones, so local communities in these remote areas rely mainly on fisheries. One million persons relying on fisheries for their subsistence. It's true. So much of the work that you're doing in an archives is you're always thinking about what what people are going to be interested in in the future. And when I think about our own archives, I would love, particularly through oral histories, to make sure that we are trying to capture as many voices as we can. The archives hold records from WCS's diverse global conservation programs, which now cover nearly 60 countries, as well as the dynamic history of WCS's five wildlife parks in New York City. WCS Wild Audio is a production of the Wildlife Conservation Society. We'll be back soon with our third season. In the meantime, catch up on all the episodes you may have missed from the first two seasons at Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or wherever you listen.